Hello, my name is Ken. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to create and enter a sandbox. From the home page, you want to click the navigator icon in the upper left corner. Expand the configuration section and click sandboxes. On the sandboxes page, you'll notice three tabs at the top available sandboxes, published sandboxes, and deleted sandboxes. By default, the page displays the Available Sandboxes tab. On the right side of the page, click Create Sandbox. On the Create Sandbox page in the Name field, enter a name for the sandbox. Since we do not want to publish the sandbox, in the Publishable field, select No. In the All Tools section, we will select all of the tools that we want to appear in our sandbox. In this case, we will select Configure Business Objects, HCM Experience Design Studio, and Page Composer. Once we have made our selection, we will click Create and Enter. When the yellow bar at the top appears, then you know that you are now in the sandbox. If you click the down arrow next to the sandbox name, you will see that you have the option to see the sandbox details and to leave the sandbox. On the right side, you can see that the sandbox is in edit mode. When you click the down arrow next to sandbox mode edit, you will see that you can be in either edit or preview as if publish mode. Click the down arrow next to tools and you will see all of the tools that we selected on the previous screen. Autocomplete rules is part of the HCM Experience Design Studio product. On the HCM Experience Design Studio page, you will notice that autocomplete rules have been enabled as it now appears in the left navigation. After you finish making changes to the application and tested them thoroughly, Publish the sandbox to make your changes available in your environment. Remember, you can only publish sandboxes with the publishable option set as yes. You must have the administrator sandbox FND underscore administrator underscore sandbox underscore PRIV privilege to publish sandboxes. Remember, you can't make further changes in the sandbox once you publish it. Do these tasks before you publish. Test or validate changes in the sandbox and preview mode. If you made changes using Page Composer, remember to close it before testing. Resolve all conflicts flagged in the merge log of your sandbox. In the sandbox toolbar, which is the yellow bar at the top of the page, click the down arrow next to the sandbox name and select Publish. Click Continue to publish. The sandbox is then published to the mainline metadata, then click Done. This concludes the explanation of how to create and enter a sandbox. Thanks for watching.